What's up, Timekeepers? Me, Tom Gamer here, and today I wanted to try out a small little phone game for you guys. Uh, I didn't know what else to record, so today I just uh, screwed around and played a little game called Paper IOS, as you can see right now that's playing. Uh, it's a fun little game. It's, uh, there, it's, it's, there's a lot of ads going on on there, but it's, uh, it's a fun little concept if you ever played like Slitter IO or all those other little games that are just like mind-numbing games you play. This one's actually pretty fun. Basically, as you're seeing right now, you're just taking over the territory or like the map and you're basically accumulating percentage and you can unlock vehicles and all those things. Right now I'm playing the cop car, I don't remember. The, all the all the, the skins are like free, if I remember correctly. So basically what you have to do is you have to expand your territory, as I said. And also what, what you just saw there is if you want to kill other play, players in the game, you can just cr go over their, um, basically their lines there, they're creating before they close the gap on their territory. And that's one way you can kill them. If you stay in your territory, it's one way of like not getting killed in the process. Uh, it's it's a fun little just a little phone game. You, uh, it's free to download. It's super fun, and no, this is not an ad, of course. I just uh, I didn't know what to play, and this one felt pretty pretty f fun little game to play. So so I decided to record it. It's uh it's actually uh, uh, as you can see here the, the the one of the important things to do here that I figured out after a while was just like don't go like this guy just turned before me and he he got me. What's cool too, you can get one extra life. To revive and get your the the, the, the place you were you were in, and uh, yeah. So what uh, what was I gonna say? One one advice if ever you guys try to try to play the game, it's really just like go a little chunks at a time. And what I found too is like right now, like you see right now, is the corners are usually the best area. You don't choose where you land in the map usually when you're playing, but the map is usually one of the best areas to start in uh, because you, at least you're you don't have to go around and check two of two at least two of your sides. Because that's the thing too is you can lose territory because like I'm doing right here I'm taking part of his territory of that person and that you lose percentage as people do that and you have to keep in mind right now I'm, I'm first place right now so it is a fun little game there's not a lot of people playing in one game so I think there's actually only uh, I think it's only 10 or something I'm not 100% sure is it right now you're seeing a top five or six right now but uh, it's uh, yeah it's a fun little game it's uh, there's a lot of skins in the game uh, I'll change I'll change out of this uh, cop skin a bit later there because actually before before this game right here, like you see right here I was so angry at that part I just decided to change my skins because there's so many you don't you know, just choose the poop because that's the way I felt like when I was playing that part so I was like fuck it I'm gonna take the, the poop one so yeah so one th one thing you have to be careful when you're doing here this at the beginning taking up big territory like this especially I'm starting like in the middle side on the side but in the middle I have to be careful especially like I'm right beside the big top dog and he for some reason he made a mistake I guess he wasn't paying attention here and I killed him right away I was pretty happy about that one uh, the, the, it's, it's, it's just a fun little game and I fucked up right here I, what, I did take an extra life though when I was playing I'll try not to talk all the way but it's it's a it's a fun little concept it's these these little IO games have come a long way since they started At the beginning everybody was like eh it started with Agario well, like if you guys remember I did it one of my first video let's play videos with Agario and now you get every fucking IO games you can imagine. Uh, there's a there's actually a battleground IO too. I think I don't remember exactly how it's called, but you you can play like for, you can play like Fortnite or whatever, collect guns, and it, it's pretty interesting. I don't know if it's an ever-ending loop. I don't remember, to, but I don't remember if at, at one point I become uh, basically the king of the map on this point. I don't think it's this one. I think it's the next one. There's actually one point in the video a bit later, and that um. That I get actually uh, take over almost a quarter of the map. You'll see that once I get there. Yeah, you have to be. Yeah, there you go. I did take first place after because I took out the big, uh, big guy pretty much. Yeah. Once you start getting bigger, you really have to start paying attention. So I do feel like right here, like the the guy in red wasn't even paying attention anymore. It doesn't confuse me because some skins do have like the same the same uh, colors. Like the the basic one you start off with, and are like the, the like the, the green color you see there. There's multiple colors, and they're all solid colors. There's nothing to them or anything. Uh, I don't remember how I got the poop and the, the poop skin though, but uh, yeah, it's really it's really always trying to keep keep the short areas as possible. Like right here, I saw he was coming in my direction. I just stopped what I was doing and just kept going. And this is where like you have to. What what sucks is if you expand too much too quickly, like like I did there. Uh, you get that you get into a space where you're just like you're just if you expand 
like vertically or horizontally too much. You have too much to cover in one area. Like this, I, I'm on the corner. I know there's nobody in those corners, so I immediately like, go for it just to try to keep that area to myself because I know nobody's going to come in those edge, on those edge. So I just go from there, take big spaces because I was lucky enough there wasn't anybody close to me while I was playing in this area except for the purple guy there. Good technique too is if you're trying, you're trying to try to stay towards in the middle there of your of your territory, so people don't really see you walking around. Because if you if I stay like if I would have stayed around here a bit more longer, people would wouldn't try to come and take some of my parts. So at least if I stay a little further in, they might not see see me because I'm on the phone, right? So you try to keep in the middle a bit more and just try to slowly creep keep creep up on them. And if when when you do stupid shit like this. And I, of course, because I was, I was so, I was so look, I was so much, con I was so concentrated looking at like trying to kill him that I crashed into the wall. And so I, I stopped paying attention there for a couple of minutes, seconds. But the, like the tip, the big top guns right beside me, you see, he's starting to take some of my territory there. But, uh, I thought I got there in time, but yeah, this is where I just started the invasion of uh, a big portion of the map. There, this is where I got my biggest high score. So I think, like, like I said there, I was hanging a bit higher. The guy in green and blue didn't even see me. As soon as he saw me, he did a U-turn, try to get back to his territory. But it's 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 a really fun concept. It's just it's uh, yeah. Once again, the same guy again. <laughs> I'm pretty sure because you can recoup, you can come back in the game pretty quickly. Once uh, if you skip the ads and all that stuff, you're lucky enough if you get like. No, this is where I got the crown at that point. If ever you do get your 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 tail get gets tagged like uh, like what just happened there is uh, you can if if you're just about to go in your territory and your your the tail your tail gets tagged and you enter the territory at your territory at the same time you don't get killed so that's one good that's one cool strategy if ever you're in a pickle uh, in the, in those cases but yeah. No, I know I'm being a bit repetitive, but it's actually a really, really fun time killer of a game if you if you guys are looking for a fun little game to play. I think at some point I eat it here. Just stop paying attention for two seconds and someone got me. It's one of those games where it's very, very unforgiving if you stop paying attention for a fraction of a second or you're, you get too cocky in one area. I think this is where I, yeah, this is where I, I just, uh, I didn't, I just didn't gauge myself. So, uh, yeah, once I start, when I, I start trying challenges here, this is probably one, th one good thing you guys can try out at the beginning if you want to practice your skills a bit more, because these are a bit harder. This is, I have to, I have to get 10% of the, of the smaller map to win this challenge, and it's pretty easy if you're in a corner again. It's one of those things where it, it, sort, of, it sort of teaches you, like, maybe stay in the corner, er, little, small areas at a time. And then the next one is yeah, ten percent with but with low speed, which is deadly slow. <laughs> like there, nobody has time to make a move here. It's almost hilarious. It's like doop, and of course, still still of the poop emoji. Of course, once again in the corner, so I, I think I take advantage of it and just like stick a big chunk out of that corner, make it a lot easier on me. Dibu, almost done. <laughs> I thought I would have got it there when I did it, but. Some of the challenges a bit later too are a lot are very cool. I think the next one is uh, it's a pretty cool one. Yeah, reach the finish line. Yeah, so you this one you have to be careful not to hit the walls. You can you can skim the wall but not crash in the walls. It's it's a one like he's going pretty fast too. So it's a fun little challenge. A cool cool little challenge to make you practice um, turning and avoiding walls and basically other people too. The next one is high speed. This one was a bit more difficult <laughs> to do. Uh, yeah, keep on locking stuff as I'm going. See, because I'm, it lo locked it right in the middle there, it just blocked me when I was trying to look at it. But yeah, high speed is really fast. And of course, one thing one thing I didn't mention is if you go into your own tail, you, you lose right away. So you have to be careful about that. <laughs> Boom. Did it. All right, so the last challenge I try is kill other players. This one is a bit more difficult because I think there's about 10 other people in the map or something. And it's a small little map. Everything's going so fast. And it took me a couple of tries to do it, but it, it is it is doable. <laughs> I didn't think I was going to like really kill everybody else. I think this is the, the shot I did it. I did die, but of course on my own fault there. But you can still use extra life on this one. 
you do have to watch ad there it is one of those games like because you don't pay for it you can pay for it but if you don't pay for it there's a lot of, a lot of freaking ads for it yeah i was just waiting for him to make one mistake so you see i'm just staying like in my little area and then he made that mistake somewhere around here close to here he decided to eat i was right beside him and he didn't even see me for some reason or i don't think he understood the challenge of the game <laughs> of the mode here of the challenge and he just went down I was like boop fuck it got it <laughs> So yeah, that's pretty fun. That was a paper IO. Hopefully you guys enjoyed a little bit more relaxed uh, playthrough here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment below. Uh, if you enjoyed paper IO, if you tried it, what's your best score that you got, uh, the percentage you uh, took over the map? Of course, follow me everywhere, me time gamer, Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, Instagram, and right here, youtube.com for slash me time gamer, where I post a new video every day of the week, Monday to Friday, 3 p.m. Eastern time. So thank you so much guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Keep on keeping on.